Cups and the Two of Pentacles. So it seems as though you you felt like you had a lot of you felt like you had a lot of um, a lot of time, a lot of time, a lot of energy, a lot of um, people around you that just kept saying, "Hey, you know, you can wait, you can wait." Really trying to focus on your stability, but it wasn't something that you really, <laughs> you still weren't really taking it seriously. So presently we have the Seven of Swords here. And with the Seven of Swords, it seems as though you kind of shield yourself from the truth of how you really want to be in a relationship. So Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, you tend to overthink um, a lot when it comes to someone even asking, hey, what do you want to do? How do you want to do it? What's going on? And so instead of pondering and asking yourself questions, you just tend to um, just overthink and keep information to yourself. Yeah, you're hoping that there's someone that's going to be coming back in your relationship. Um, you're trying to avoid conflict and you're really hoping that you're able to uh, attract someone back into your life here. We have the Three of Swords, Five of Wands in reverse, and Eight of Cups all in reverse. So that's how you're presently feeling. Now, when it comes to your future, it seems as though with your future we have the Four of Cups. So it it seems like this person that you're hoping for, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, this person does come back into your life. Now, this could be happening to you or vice versa. This person does come back into your life. There ha There is a reconciliation. But when you have this reconciliation, you start to wonder, you know, is, is this person right for me? Am I really ready for a stable, committed relationship? And Spirit is saying, yes, there's going to be a difficult moment that's coming up soon. Thank you. In the next three to six days, weeks, or months, uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And it feels as though you're, you're um, having a lot of... Um, here the tower four of wands and the devil so it seems like um this person that wants to be completely truly committed to you in this relationship this individual does um they might do let's say um they might be a lawyer or they might be um police uh enforcement or not really police enforcement like lawyer or um, or a Capricorn, um, a person on Wall Street, like that type of energy, like, so that, this individual that you're, um, dealing with right now, um, they do seem to come back into your life, you do seem to have some sort of stability with them, um, you like how structured they are, the only thing is, is that, um, there's going to be some sort of, uh, system, like a, a, a break that you guys are going to be going through. So either that happened just recently or you're going to be going through a major break with this person. Oh, no, you're wanting a reconciliation. So um, this after this break with this person, it seems like it's a pretty bad break. Uh, you tend to get closer to this person. They kind of just come out of nowhere um, expecting help from you. But you don't see coming at the bottom of the deck the Seven of Swords. So it seems like you're really working on the betrayal of this person. It seems like this person was actually um, involved with other people as to why you felt they have betrayed you um, or they took someone else's side. Thank you, Spirit is telling me that they took someone else's side over yours. And you're not too uh, pleased about that. All right, we're gonna move on to fire signs. 